welcome to this edition of the Profile Police with Andrew and... Hey, Z. Here you go. Here yeah. you go. And we know, I have Today. to sit between them. We know they don't go again. No. Okay. No. No. She likes it. Yeah. Apparently. <sighs> okay. Now, we did a thing recently where I read you some of the bad profile, uh, the bad first contact from him, but not the worst ones, not the ones I'd immediately deleted. You wanted to know where they went. Well, I put up a new profile, just for fun, and just for you, so that you could get some of the first contacts that just shouldn't have ever happened. So, um, I'll just quickly read you the profile that I put up. Um, I did admittedly pop on a blonde wig and flash a bit of cleavage, but the profile reads, About me. My personality is a puzzle wrapped up in an enigma surrounded by a cloud of sarcasm. Slight hint there, guys. What should it matter what I write here? You won't read it anyway, because you just want to find out what sort of man or sex I'm looking for. Here's a hint. I find someone who can read a profile thoroughly enough to know that wit is a form of foreplay to me. So it's fairly clear. What I'm asking for you to have done is to look past the cleavage shot and read it. My ideal partner, a man who can make me laugh and make me orgasm. We've got to put some sexy stuff in there. I am not looking for anything permanent, but if you can make me come again, you can come again and again. So she's funny, she's sexy, she's sassy, hmm. and here are the responses she warranted. But before, we, Adrian and I are going to do some dramatic readings mm. here. I'm going to practice my phone sex voice on this. But Em, do, how many and in what time frame did these pop up? Oh, okay, so I put it up at 9pm. The photos weren't approved for possibly up to 12 hours. By 8am the next morning, there was 193 messages and 200 and something winks. After 24 hours, when I suspended the profile again, we were up to 353 messages and fuck knows how many winks. <laughs> so I haven't even read all these messages. I've just quickly grabbed a few off of there, printed them out for the boys, and here they are. Well, darling, you don't have to read any more because we've found your man <laughs> in here. We've found the man. Yeah. There's a few, actually. I'm, yeah. I'm hoping that you're able to discern between these catches. Yes. Yes. And look, ladies, if you see the man of your dreams in any of these we read, just bribe us and we might give you their contact details. Mm -hmm. Or just put a cleavage shot on AMM and they'll contact you. They'll come to you. Mm -hmm. but, but like this, this is like seriously, I'll start with a couple short ones because there's a couple of long ones. There's narratives, there's sexy fantasies. But these, this, this is, someone expects someone, to, uh, a woman to respond to this. Loved UR profile, as in your profile. Would love to meet. Interested? We will have a good time. I am good with my tongue and finger at the same time with Italian cock. Is it just, it's like he's, he's tongue and finger, but he's brought along some Italian cock to go with it. <laughs> See, that's the kind of, that's the kind of thoughtfulness that we're looking for. Yeah. Now, a man who can bring along mm, Italian cock today. Yeah. Yes. The ladies like it. Hmm. Who, who have you got there, AZ? Um, <clears throat> I'm going to be putting on my special reading voice because, uh, well, try not, to, try to hold back, okay. you know, restrain yourself. There's a couple here, actually. We'll just run them in together. Okay. <clears throat> you look sexy as reading your profile turned me on. God, imagine what you could do to me in real life. Would love to catch up and surf as any chimes through there. Yeah, you do it to him. You're always going to do it to him. You'll watch the footy, but you could do it to him. <laughs> Got another one here. I found your man. Hey, cutie. My name is Beeped. How are you? I'll tell you how you are. You're fucking hot. Is what you are, id. Fly to Victoria to fuck you for sure. I have a nine inch dick and he'd love to have all nine in you. He'd love to taste your pretty little pussy too. Oh, uh, man, what a what a I'm hard because yeah. of it. And as, oh. yeah, I know it's a sex site, but, but you haven't even winked at me. I haven't even said I like you, the look of your profile. Nothing. We've had oh. no contact. Mm. Now, we, w we were um, <laughs> pointing out in previous things, um, Emma and I are both of the opinion, if you don't use proper grammar, spelling, 
capitalization, you look like an idiot and you're going to be ruled out. So, and that's why we're reading them as they're spelled. Um, this one is just classic. There's no capitalization, lowercase i for i's, and a bunch of run-on sentences. So I'll read it how it plays out to me in my head. Hi, you have a nice profile. I like it. I'm young, young good-looking guy and fit, honest with humor and respect, genuine. I would love to meet you. I live in... Yeah, I bet you do. And I travel to meet people. If you want to meet or talk, just feel free to add me. And with all with all love and respect. Oh, that's Aww, sweet. That's, that's sweet. Good. That's, good. That's, good. That, that's a nice touch. The rest yeah. is shit. <laughs> but that was a nice touch. Well, yeah. I've found, found another man for okay. you. Okay. <clears throat> I'm waiting. And uh, I think he uh, lives next door to Beep. Mm, you're a sexy looking bitch. Would like nothing better than you on my face, my tongue deep in you, hot, wet, delight. You smothering my face with fuckious, mmm, love the taste. Grind it, grind it. Oh, and you know when you do then click on this guy's profile, it's yeah, not pretty. Uh -huh. Hope you've managed to get this far. If so, congratulations. If not, I know where you live. <laughs> Kidding! Because serial killer jokes are a great icebreaker. Especially oh on God. a dating site. Jesus. Yeah. Okay, so he gives leading and then he gets into his sexy story. And I do give him credit for trying, but see how this works for you ladies. I could visit you as a plain clothes detective investigating a prowler. And I ask if I can come in to ask questions. You offer me a cuppa. I say I need a drink that's stiffer than that. So you make me one and I ask you questions and you answer. My aim will be to make you feel as safe as a woman can feel. However, I have a secret agenda that conflicts. You work towards trusting me. You try slowly to seduce me. I will give you opportunities for you to flaunt or express your desire. You will put me in a strong position of conflict of interest. Personal versus professional behaviour. Then again, we might meet for coffee, then go our separate ways. <laughs> Sorry, hang on. Hey, 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 I'm playful, not weird. Right. Oh, this is still going. This is, okay. I'm like halfway through. <laughs> I'm halfway through. And I just realised in this fantasy, he's playing clothes. He's not in a uniform. So actually, no. Where's the sex? He's not even dressing he's up. He's not even in a uniform. Is that really? Is that just a cop out for him not even bothering to dress up? Pretty much. If you're gonna play out a fantasy, fuck it, fuck out for the uniform. Bro. He's just gonna come from work in a suit and say hello on the plain clothes police. Yeah. For, okay. So he's not weird, right? Tell no, me he's, more, he's more. not. Okay. <laughs> I, I, sorry, I just, I just had to express that force. Yeah, no, because it's not weird. Okay. Oh. That, that's the prize catches that are out there. Like, and seriously, if, if you want more, we can. Uh, they, they don't, just don't stop. But um, having found that, a few people have actually sent us in some of their own profiles, and they seem relatively sane. Mm. And um, next week we'll work on them. You're, you're so turned on by that. You're looking at me with yeah. love. Yeah. I can tell. Yeah. I told you there was a reason I was sitting in the middle. Just she likes it. And, look, we'll see you again soon. <laughs>